Hi everyone, you're watching Real Talk Tobacco. I'm Shauna Marula from Action on Smoking and Health. Ash. The impact of trade on tobacco can seem complicated, but there are only six main things you need to know. Number one, tobacco is unique among consumer products. When used exactly as intended, tobacco products kill. Therefore, tobacco should be exempted or carved out from trade agreements. Number two, free trade agreements are meant to increase consumption. Increasing consumption of tobacco products would lead to additional deaths. Tobacco products and services must be explicitly excluded. This would remove the tobacco industry's ability to benefit from free trade agreements. Number three, tobacco industry manipulates trade law as a way to threaten and sue government. Tobacco companies know that they're unlikely to prevail in these trade cases. The suits are filed in order to frighten governments with heavy litigation costs. Number four, there is an irreconcilable conflict between public health and the tobacco industry. Unlike other products that can become harmful if overused and abused, there is no safe use of tobacco. Number five, in the Trans-Pacific Partnership or TPP negotiations, the U.S. is pushing to help corporations, including the tobacco industry. TPP is a free trade agreement currently being negotiated between the United States and 11 other countries around the Pacific. Once completed, it will be the world's largest trading bloc. Number six, including tobacco as a normal product in trade treaties can lead to greater risk of disease and death. One billion people will die this century from tobacco unless drastic action is taken. One of the critical preventative actions needs to be the carve out of tobacco products from free trade agreements. Voice your agreement by sharing this video on Facebook or Twitter using the hashtag carve out. I'm Shauna Narula, and you're watching Real Talk Tobacco.